Hey everyone, we're going to evaluate these three functions and we're going to uh, do these on different slides. So we're going to do this one first, then this one, and we're going to evaluate, for example, number one, we're going to evaluate with f of negative 4 and f of 9a. So we're going to do three of these. So for the first one, we have f of x equals 4x minus 3. And we're going to evaluate uh, f of negative 4 and f of 9a. So what I do is everywhere there's an x here, I'm going to input negative 4. So f of negative 4 equals 4. What I tend to do with the x, I just put parentheses. I write out the whole equation. And now I'm going to input my negative 4. So that's going to equal negative 16 minus 3, and this equals negative 19. Okay, and the second one is 9a, so I'm going to do the same thing. f of 9a equals 4. I leave a parenthesis for the 9a and uh, write that in there. And we get 36a minus 3. If you want, you can factor out... Uh, the 3, and write this as 12a minus 1. Either way, these are both right. Okay, the last one, or the second one, is this one. And the first one's pretty easy. Uh, everywhere there's an x, uh, put a 0. So basically, those would cancel. Negative 4 divided by negative 2 is just 2. You could have also factored this out, expanded it, and wrote f of x equals x minus 2 times x plus 2 over uh, divided by x minus 2, and this would have canceled out. So it had been a lot easier just to put the 0 in here and you would have still gotten the answer too. So for the second one, I mean this uh, f of negative 6, I'm going to go ahead and use my uh, simplified f of x, which is f of x equals x plus 2. It makes it a lot easier, and I'm just going to put in for the x, I'm going to substitute with negative 6. So negative 6 plus 2 is negative 4. Okay, on the last one, it's a little harder, so I'm going to do the same thing. I'm just going to write f, I mean h, of negative 7a equals, and I'm going to uh, put parentheses where the x is, and then I'm going to substitute with negative 7a. So don't forget, you're going, this, um, the square just means we're multiplying this twice. You can just write it down twice. So when you do that, negative 7 times negative 7 is 49. And then a times a is a squared minus 4. Okay? And on this one, the h, we're going to do h of x plus 1. Everywhere there's an x, I'm going to put a parentheses. And I'm going to input x plus 1. Now, if you know your formulas, you can use that, but basically, I'm just going to write this twice. And you can FOIL this out, or use the fact that a plus b squared equals a squared plus 2ab plus b squared. So... I'm just going to use my formula here. So I'm going to square my a plus 2ab, which is 2x, plus 1, 1 squared, minus 4. And you're going to have to combine those two. So that's going to equal x squared plus 2x, and 1 minus 4 is minus 3. And that's your final answer. And that's all. Thanks for watching and have a nice day. Bye-bye.